Hey, you're watching UCTV Sports. I'm Eric Galicchio, and I'm with two special guests of the UConn Huskies football team. I'm going to have them introduce themselves. Hello, I'm Omar Fort. Um, I'm a junior. Um, I'm a DB, and um, my major is Urban and Community Studies and a minor in Real Estate. Uh, hey, guys, my name is Matthew Parrott. I'm an offensive lineman here on the UConn football team. Uh, my allied health sciences major with a minor in uh, psychology, women's gender, sexuality studies. Um, thanks for having us. So talk about some of the strides you guys have made this off season as well as uh, spring ball. Coach King, uh, our strength and conditioning, yeah, our strength and conditioning coach, uh, he's done a wonderful job preparing us uh, physically uh, during our sprints and during in the weight room, just getting bigger, um, bringing that energy, and, and that's the edge that we need to be uh, a team to reckon with in the future. Um, and as far as spring ball, I think uh, I'm just going to speak for the defense. I think we came along very well. Um, uh, Coach Spanos did a wonderful job just making sure we're aggressive and just being on the same page. All we have, all we have to do is just all come together and just play, play as one, and then I think the sky's the limit from there. Yeah, um, to add on from an offensive standpoint, you know, uh, we got a new offensive coordinator, um, uh, my offensive line coach, uh, Coach Joffrey, uh, my guy. And, you know, it's just really um, for our main focus this spring ball was to, you know, just to harp in on, um, you know, fine-tuning the things that we just needed to fix during from the course of the season so it wasn't like adding any trick plays just making sure that you know our base offense our base uh, pass and run game were just smooth and sound and everyone's on the same page you know matt you are uh, gonna be a senior this year this is kind of crazy right yeah, no, by. <laughs> yeah. so this is kind of like your last hurrah to kind of you know make a mark for the program as well as get the attention of scouts in the nfl mm -hmm. um have you learned anything for some of the players before you about the process and what you have to do to be in the position to succeed? Oh, most level. definitely. Um, you know, the one big thing that I'm trying to um, do right now is be more of a vocal leader, especially because, you know, our team is still uh, relatively young. And, you know, I, I can see it right now, the young guys are stepping up and speaking out more, which is phenomenal. But like I said, from the older guys, um, like, you know, uh, just like like I said, Crozier, like Foley, or like Andreas Canapi, Rich Levy, all those guys, like I've learned things differently from every one of them. Yeah, so Omar, uh, your brother played in the NFL? Right. What what did you learn from him growing up? Um, um, so he was always like one of the big guys. Like he was um, U.S. Army All-American um, growing up, top ten linebacker in the country. So I mean that's my role model. I look up to him for everything, and uh, I would say what I learned most from them is just uh, not to be average. Um, to go to the league, you have to be very special. And Matt Pert is in that one percent of that one percent that's going to the league. <laughs> but um, yeah, so with that, it comes with working working hard and just doing the extra work and just not backing down, knowing that you you have what it takes and, and just being determined in your mind because it's, as soon as you put your mind to it, you, the sky's the limit. Shout out to UCTV. Thank you for having us. Most definitely. Thank you. It was a definite pleasure to be with you. Wonderful experience.